been snowing in the Coburg Hills northeast of Eugene, so we're headed up McGowan Creek Road to check it out. You may remember this area from my Mohawk off-roading video, as well as the follow-up video with Sarah and Aaron of PNW Crosstrek. Snow is rare in western Oregon, and as usual, this storm brought none to the valley floor. It's a treat, however, to be able to find so much snow without trekking all the way to the upper elevations of the Cascade Range. There are a lot of vehicles up here. I mean, really a lot. I've never seen anywhere near this many rigs up this road. Notice how this Toyota pickup saw us coming and pulled over in a wide spot. Notice also how I saw those trucks coming and pulled over because I had a wide spot available. Unfortunately, not everyone up here is exercising basic trail etiquette, as I found out when an inconsiderate jerk in a green Dodge pickup decided to go by on the wrong side of the road and ran me into the ditch. There are already several rigs stacked up in both directions waiting for us to get recovered, and in my haste I haven't really deployed the expul traction boards properly. I should have taken the time to dig out the snow in front of my rear tires, which has really locked me in. I certainly could have dug out better below my front tires as well to get the boards more firmly seated underneath. Ultimately, it's pointless for me to try the self-recovery here, as someone has already come along and offered to give me a tug. Thank you, sir. Much appreciated. There's no point in continuing up into the hills. Too many people here, and we don't want to risk the same thing happening again. Instead, we've driven back down into the Mohawk Valley, proceeded several miles north up past the town of Marcola, and we're headed back up into the hills via Shotgun Creek Road instead. This is so much better. There's almost no one up this way, and the forester feels super planted in this deep, fresh snow. We've stopped to have a look at Odin McGrew Spring. We're nearly at the highest point of this ridgeline, and there is so much snow. Looks a little different than it did last time we were up here.
It's late and getting dark. Time to head back down into the valley, air up, and head home.